I thought it'd be fun to take a look at a tree uh, that dominates the area where we live in Baguio City, and that's the Benguet Pine Tree. What you're looking at here is the oldest Benguet Pine in Baguio City. It's estimated at 150 years old. These trees can get some really interesting formations in their crowns. Uh, branches will break in storms and then what's left will be growing at an odd angle and then more will break off and they'll be left growing at another angle so you can end up with a really unique and beautiful looking crown in these trees. Uh, nearby, uh, there's a, another Benguet pine tree and it had a few branches fall off of it in a recent storm. And so that kind of gives us the opportunity to take a look at the cones and the needles of these up close. Uh, the needles of these grow in groups of three as you can see here. Here you can see the female cones, the seed producing cones, and how they grow on the branches. These ones aren't quite mature, they're not opened up yet. And on this branch you can see some male cones as well as there's a small orchid on it. Often these small twigs will blow down in storms and quite a few of these orchids grow on these, but you can also see here the male pollen producing cones. The wood of these trees is quite beautiful. It almost has a metallic luster to some of the boards. Uh, cutting Benguet pines is highly regulated, so usually if you see Benguet pine wood, it's going to be in an older building. So this is the floor in an older building. You can see the grain can vary quite a bit, as can the color of the boards. Really a beautiful wood. Really beautiful tree inside and out. So uh, let's plant more of these and conserve them so that we can enjoy them and all of their benefits in the future. Thanks everybody.